Welcome guys to the 1y0. Let's understand how to solve linear programming equation through the actual. Let us understand first the question, then we'll solve in the actual. Okay. Question given the condition if we are making a product A, then we will get 15 rupees per unit profit. And on product B, we are getting a profit of 20. And product C, we are getting a profit of 40. Under the constraint, if we are using material 1, so making a product, we are required 5 unit of material and for product V, 6 and for product C, 4 and total material is 210. So we are making all of these products, we have to maintain 210 as a unit of material 1. Similarly as material 2, you can see 10 unit required for A, 8 unit for B and 5 unit for C. And total material is 200 similar in the material 3 we have total material 170 for which a required 4 b required 2 and c required 5 unit so we will formulate this first constraint in the excel we have write material uh, abc that is not abc that is material 1 material to material 3 okay so these are the abc constraint we have put it that for material a material a required 5 units b required 6 units and c required 4 units we'll write down all these respectively for the material 2 and material 3 we'll leave one column blank for finding actual value to be used by solving using the solvers so first we'll leave this as a blank and these are the constraint given by given the question that for material 1 we have 210 units for material 2 we have 200 units and material 3 we have 170 units fine now the condition is given that we have a profit of 15 units on product a product b have a 20 units and product c have a 14 rupees per unit so on the basis of this, this is our objective function. We have to maximize this thing to get a maximum profit. So, to getting a maximum profit, we need to uh, we need to have that time that term uh, that type of combination of both the unit so that we can get a maximum profit by using this constraint also. So, for this, we using some product function these are the profit and these are the vari variables of unit that we need to solve by solve by. okay right now it is zero as we have no value for the quantity that, that need to be solved by solve by. okay these are the decision variable you know okay and similarly we will use this for the uses the material required when we after solving this okay and some product this comma this okay same some product comma this one Equal to some product so on the basis of decision variable this value will get changed that is the total material used by by actual maximizing our profit so now we'll go into the data using a data analysis and solver tool so if we are not getting that solver tool then simply you have to go in file options we'll find add-ins of this one then you have to go this one and click on analysis tool and solver add-in and then click ok you will get this tool on your excel fine okay now we'll use solver for this okay 
this is already solved i need to delete this one first mm. okay now which is our objective function this is our objective function as we have multiply both some product this as the combination of our product in unit with respect to per unit profit so this is our objective function we have to maximize this profit so we have select maximize if we have to uh, minimize this then we have to select minimum function okay right now we are selecting a maximum okay like what are the changing variable we are selecting the changing variable are the number of unit need to be produced for product a b and c that is these are the changing variable now we have to add constraint for the constraint cancel for the constraint we have to click here add then the call reference constraint one we have already mentioned that uss right uss should be a sum of product or variable of that unit of product abc and the unit required to make this product okay so in the this we will use this is less than two this because we cannot use more than 210 material for uh, material one okay then the next constraint come this should be less than this the next constraint will come this this should be less than equal to this okay okay this is our simply done everything now we have to select simplex lp to solve this okay to solve this that you can get answers sensitivity and limit okay okay so after solving this we are getting product as a geo unit product v as 5 unit and product c is 30 units and for 5 4 p it is the maximum profit we are getting and using we are using this much of material only and after this we have get this we are using only this much material that means some material need to be get not utilizing that is called select and so we can simply using by this minus this so this much of material is getting wasted so here's the answer 548 the maximum profit we are getting this is the limit limit report after getting how much we are getting a range of that limit to be used and these are sensitivity and report or product and this is a answer report you can analysis all this report of the, our solution okay so 